Hey there, it's Chris Seb with Sourcegraph, and in this video, we are going to talk about unit testing in JetBrains IDEs. Here I have a Next.js application. I'm gonna open up a file, we'll call it chat form. And this is a React component with a form in it. What I'm gonna do is we'll open Kodi, and we'll mention this file at chat form. And I'm gonna say, how can I write a test for this file. So this is one way to do it, and Cody will go ahead and write the test for us. It'll give us instructions on how to run the test, give us all our test cases, and that's all well and good, but I think we can do a little bit better. So what we have now are these Cody commands, and with these commands, we have edit code, we have document code, and we have one called generate unit test. So while I'm in this chat form.tsx, let's say I want to click generate unit tests, generating code edits, and it goes ahead and actually creates a brand new file here, chat form.test.tsx, writes all the things that we need, does our imports, comes down here, even writes the specific test cases here, renders form and text area, calls handle change when text area value changes. So that generate unit test command, give it a try. I think you'll find that it helps speed up writing those tests and you know, who loves writing tests? And if you see something in this test that you don't really like, you can always highlight it and ask Cody to edit. I think this test is fine. What I'm gonna do though is I will go over to Cody, I'm in my commands panel and I'll click document code. And Cody will go ahead and write a little comment just for that test case. So you can generate your unit test, you can ask Cody to make edits to it, and hopefully that speeds up writing your tests. All right, thanks for watching.